everybody and welcome back to City Skylines. So today we are waiting for things to kind of start to grow again. Because we have literally no demand for anything. So it is making things a little bit hard. However, it does look like the expansion that we did last time has started to grow up. Um, yeah. But it's not getting very much residential, but the commercial is all there. And the residential is starting to get there. Which is hopefully going to mean that this industry over here will have the jobs it wants. And all that fun stuff. Over here in our forestry industry, it's doing okay. So we've got a bit of a police problem down here. It's not police, this is it's right next to the police station. They should be fine. Okay, so the main thing we're waiting for is for this area over here to grow. We've got some industrial starting to pop up. Look, there's our first little bits of our oil industry. Next to some incineration plants. So that should hopefully provide us with some oil for our actual industries. And there is a cargo train station here that we haven't linked up to anything. But it's probably going to be pretty easy to link it up to the... We'll probably link it up just to the um, this line over here. It's probably going to be our best bet. instead of trying to get it to link up to our lines. No. That way, please. So hopefully now that will link up. And then we might do the same over here when we get one, is link it up to the line that's already here. Because my guess is, is somewhere these will link up to the rest of our industrial lines. And we have got a few that link up to the regional line, so yeah. Our main concern right now is money. We're not making very much of it. And this, oh look, it has our first industrial shop is coming up. Uh, not industrial, commercial presence is over here now. Uh, one thing I would like to add over here once we get the 60,000 is its own bus station. And then it will have a route to all the different bus stations and then a route into here. I know there already is one but it would be nice to have one that's a little bit closer to this industrial area and to over here is going to be the plan. Look, our commercial demand is starting to spike again. So hopefully this will actually grow. And hopefully now, since a lot of the industrial doesn't have to go that way, it will stop messing up with these roads. So much. Oh look, we're over 60,000 now. So let's get ourselves a bus station. It is. Have I got anywhere where it's going to fit nicely? I think we'll have it over here. I preferably would like it on a big road. But then I also want it to be a little bit more disguised. But it doesn't look like we can get it on to one of the big roads. I suppose we get it here. It's probably not a bad place to have one. So let's do some routes then. So this one is going to go around the main city, say. 
And then we'll also have one that goes around the suburbs. that and then we'll do one for the suburbs just gonna go around the outside but it will link up this area that a little bit better to the rest of the city And then that one will go through this middle bit. I'll link up at that stop and this stop, and then we'll, it'll have a stop here too. Then we'll have one that goes to the industrial district, like so. Just going to go around the outside. And then back. Then we'll have one that goes into here. It's going to go where the other one doesn't go. So like around here. Through here. To there this point to that point and then down into this new section that we did so it does a lot more of the bottom section of this this area and then it can go up in and back out is what we'll say And we'll do one for this industry section, which will stop here, and then we'll go round this way. And stop there. So it's a slightly different route. And then we're going to want one to go over here. And back. We're going to want one that goes to the one in the city. If there is space in our city ones, I think there is just one left. And then we'll get a bus on this one. And then we're going to want one that goes over here too so many buses the idea is to make people want to live over here and then we'll get one that goes to the airport too it's a bit of a trek but there you go you can get to the airport from here too. So that is all the buses in. Our commercial demand is still starting to spike. So, but it's not really growing too much yet over this way. I'm going to colour this whole section in with commercial. So this is going to be the commercial block of this section. Then we'll probably have an office block. And then the rest will all be residential. It's probably what we're going to do. Um, now we can probably afford ourselves a nice big police station. So we'll get one. To help encourage the growth over this way.
I wonder when our first buses are going to come in. Right now we're just getting some deliveries it looks like and oh a few cars are coming. A few more. Yeah, so now there is a need to go this way on the highway. It's great. It's not a one way. I was just thinking, is that a one way street so people can't get through either way? But no, it is. It is a two way. It's all good. Garbage is piling up. We're fine for capacity, it's just going to be a traffic issue. Oh, look at all this commercial now. It's all starting to come, get, to come together. And that is starting to increase demand for other things. But I do want to wait for us to get some money. Like, I want to get some fire stations in over this way, really. Like, we could do with a little one there. We'll say for at least now. Until I can afford a big one. I might do the same over here. Let's just get a little one in somewhere. Until I can afford a better one. So far over here is very quiet. But the, it, it's so nice to see traffic starting to use this section of the highway. It needs a little bit of adjusting here and there. It really does. Let's see if we can get this bit so it looks a little bit better yeah starting to look a little bit better then might take this bit a little bit further out so it matches in a little bit better kind of looks better but we'll just have to see uh, looks like we've used up all of our limited demand that we had and it looks like we need a park over here to carry the electricity I want something a bit big but not too big a nice plaza would probably look good I have one here and one here and that should yeah carry the electricity and maybe encourage some more people to move in over here oh look the, the first buses are coming do they have anybody on them nope and nope Uh, what about you? No. Nope. suppose since we don't actually have a bus station over this way, we aren't really going to have um, a bus depot, do we? So the buses do have a way to travel before they become useful. Right, so I'm going to start adding in the high density residential section that we're going to have. And then we are going to have an elementary school in it. And we will have a high school once we can afford it.
open again? I doubt we're going to see much actually happening over this way. Right, oh, ooh, we can probably afford our high school now. I'm going to get the high school over here. Oh, look, there's another bus coming. And another, oh, it's a pink bus this time. Still, uh, no one on it, though. Oh look, the traffic is starting to back up over here. Where's it going? Over this way. And it's struggling to merge it looks like. Okay, let's have it so this one... Oh, okay. They can only go into that one. And then this, and then we will change how they merge here, so they can merge one lane at a time. There we go, and then do the same here. Okay. So hopefully that will help this section getting on and off. Also probably need to do the same here. So you can only go into that lane. These ones can go into that one and that one. That one or that one or that one. Or this one and this one. See if that helps. As this seems to be where our back off is Oh, it really is backing up. And then it's backing up over here. Over here too. But why is it backing up on this roundabout? It shouldn't be. This roundabout should be able to deal with this amount of traffic. Where are we? Oh, we're coming into the city. I see. How is this one working? See, th this one is working okay, actually. I might get one of them in instead. So let's get one of them in. So if you over here, I think it's this one we want. Yeah, about there-ish. Okay. Now we want to get in. Oh no, we put it in the wrong way round. So we've got the wrong one. We want the other one. And then underground. So we want this one. The slope is too steep. Damn it. Come on.
anywhere where it would fit. Hmm. We left hand drive? I can't remember. Yes. No. We want right hand drive then. Rid of this and let's get the other one. Then. Hopefully it will not say slope is too steep. Is there a left hand version? Ah, oh, it doesn't seem like there is. Damn it, we can't fit anything in. Come on, see if I can fit this in. Probably not. Probably not. So what we want is this. Bird is saying the slope is too steep. <sighs> hmm. Um. I just want something the traffic is going to be able to cope with. And oh, these seem to be the best thing. That we've actually downloaded. It's good for this, so this is huge. Plus then it goes into a normal road afterwards. Oh no! Why did I not do both? Hmm. Um, I don't know. I really don't know what to put in right now. This roundabout was not working. We'll just have to put the roundabout back. But maybe we won't upgrade its lanes this time. And there we want just six lanes with trees. Upgrade, upgrade, and upgrade. And then we'll just attach this a little bit. Oh, well we've got a tiny bit of road there in the middle. Alright, let's see if that works any better. And I mean, I know it's just still a roundabout, but there's less lanes on it. We are probably going to want to traffic manage it. That one can go to that one to that. This one can go into all three. And that one has to stay there. Then when you turn, this is the one you turn in. I 
And this one you can go into all three. Technically, though, you shouldn't be going back out, should you? And then these, you go into this first lane only. Actually, no, you can go into any lane. Go into the lane you need, it's fine. So let's just mess with that. There you go. And then we'll also do this junction too. This is your turning lane. This can go into that lane or that lane. And this one can go into that lane or that lane. And there we go. Same over here. This is the lane for turning. This is the lane to go into that lane or that lane. And this lane. You can go into that one or the middle. And then this is going to be your turning lane. There. So that should work better. Is what I'm hoping. Then at this merging point, I want to make sure that only changing one lane. Because right now it's that merge point that's causing the issues. I'll say this lane you can go into that one or that lane, we'll say. Because this is backing up everything else right now. I mean, it's backing up all the way to the next junction, you know? How is over here doing? Oh, it's looking quite nice. I'm impressed. Doesn't like we've got many people using the bus station yet. But that's okay. I just can't believe how busy the highway is and it's all going the same way. It probably would help if they would use more than one of the lanes. Um, so let's do a little bit of lane manager. As I don't want them going like that. And then here is the next 
So. This one is only going to be turning for now. Here, if you're going to merge, you can merge like this. There we go. And then here, again, I'm going to set up merge points. I don't get why they're going so slow on this stretch of road. There you go, it looks like it's all working out where it needed to go, I think. Now it's using the highway slightly better. The traffic should kind of decrease. It's not, I know. Um, one thing I might do is put traffic lights on this. So they both have even times to get off the bit of highway. I think that will help as well. Because I think this sort of lane was holding them up too much. There you go, that is looking a little bit better. See that one's not holding up the traffic. The biggest problem it's kind of tempting to make this a one that has travel lights on. That one shouldn't need travel lights. Just because then it may flow a little better. may not. We'll just have to have a little look and see. I don't think the traffic lights have helped. Let's turn them off. Let's turn it off and try again. I mean, I still can't believe it's like pretty much one lane of traffic the whole way there. There are more lanes you could be using, guys. Oh, whoops. In the wrong mode.
and then this one will go into that thing. It does seem like the traffic lights are kind of doing something for us. What I don't get is the fact that everyone is hanging out in that one lane. Um, let's go back a little bit further then with our merging rules. And we'll go back another three, we'll say. With hopes that they realise that they can use more than one lane to get to where they want to go. Okay, let's try that. Can't believe so many of them wait to up there to the moon. You know where you're going. Merge further up. Okay. Oh, look at all these buses have arrived. And look, we've even got people waiting for buses too. How cool is that? Anyway, this is where we'll leave this episode of Sea Skies. It went on a little longer than I thought it would. But I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please give this video a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.